Rock Creek Parkway back open this noon following an early morning crash. Two people, a man and a woman, were pulled out of a car after it crashed into the water near 23rd and P Streets Northwest. John Gonzalez has the story. The driver of this small car, what appears to be a brand new Mini Cooper, still with paper tags on it, drove off the road early this morning. Police are still trying to figure out why. First responders arrived to find two people trapped inside the convertible that was flipped over and submerged in the creek. It's still unclear how long they had been in the water. It's a curve, might have been a little fast and with the rain. Our cameras captured this exclusive video of the woman being rushed to the hospital after being pulled from the wrecked car. She was unconscious, suffering very serious injuries. We're getting different reports that there were people that pulled from out of the car, but law enforcement personnel were on scene pretty quickly. A trapped man was also rescued. Police are still trying to determine who was driving and if speed, weather or alcohol played factors here. Police say this happened at around 2.30 this morning and down below you can see where the car left the road nearly striking a light pole and leaving a hubcap behind. Also a lot of debris from the street signs that were broken. And you can also see many tire marks on the grass just before the car plunged into the creek. You have to be careful uh, in bad weather at 2.30 in the morning. It's dark. The car actually crossed two lanes of traffic at the curve here at Rock Creek Parkway in Georgetown. Well, we have one in critical condition. That's the woman. That's a female occupant. Cindy Maldonado watches in disbelief from above on the P Street Bridge. Her friend lost control of his car nearly in the same spot 15 years ago. He actually was paralyzed due to the accident. So I know that that happens a lot, actually. They actually should put some kind of guardrail there. In Northwest Washington, John Gonzalez, ABC 7 News.